Okay. So you're going to see some pictures at the end of this. But I can tell you, it was easy to set up. It was easy to use. I mean, basically all you do is you can either use the strap to tie it down or you can use the mount. And you can mount this in almost any vertical, horizontal direction, however you want to do it. And everything works fine. The sensors work good. It picked up, you'll see, picked up my dog going across the yard there. So, five stars. And I probably should mention, if I didn't already, I can't remember. It will operate on four batteries. But if you're going to leave it for a lengthy period of time, or just so you have, you know, plenty of backup, because you don't want, if you're actually looking for something that's getting into yard or, or hunting or something like that, put all eight of them in there. Okay? That's why it comes with four. I couldn't understand why it came with four and had eight slots. So I had to read up on it. Basically, the four is what it takes to operate. The other four just gives it longevity so it'll work longer. So there you are. Five stars. Works great. Well made. Does everything it's supposed to do. Five stars. You need to get one of these. And I should mention, they're also good because I had... Um, some problems at the back of my yard that obviously I can't reach with Wi-Fi. So I'm going to put this out there and see if I can't capture something. So enjoy. And I just realized something. All those pictures you're going to see are with a plastic film covering over the lens. So just imagine what it'd be like if I had paid better attention. Okay. Five stars, definitely. Okay, I about got this thing set up. I'm about to take it outside so we can take some video and maybe a photo and you can get an idea of the quality of this thing. Now, so far, the setup is pretty easy. You just put it, put your batteries in. And it only takes four. It comes with four. Okay, but I put the whole eight in there. Okay, and select anything you want to do. Now, of course, the first thing you want to do probably is format your SD card. So... Just be aware of that. And there's, there's your memory card selection. And you can go into there and, and format your, video, your SD card. So, let's put this thing into use here. Now, first thing you do after you put all this, there's a switch here. Okay. I don't know how well it says. Basically, though, all the way over is ready to go in the middle where I'm at right now is kind of a test mode. So, just hang in there and I'm going to take this outside and see if I can get us some pictures. Okay, I got my wildlife camera in today. I'm excited to check it out and see how I like it. Nicely packaged. This is a user manual. What we need is my camera right here. Looks nice and sturdy, like pretty good quality. Open it up here. Nice, it has screen and you can actually watch all your pictures and videos right on the screen here. That is nice. Some of the batteries are gonna go right down there. Might need a little screwdriver to get that open. on there it does come with a set of batteries looks like yeah, that's great doesn't seem to have enough batteries does have the attachment to charge and this is a way to mount mount the camera somewhere this is great I'm excited to try this out